welcome to Guernsey and uh, we're in slow moving traffic heading up towards Capel School so how's everyone doing back in the van again welcome to the drive along here in Guernsey it's about I don't know it's about seven o'clock and it's just looking beautiful the sky can you see in the distance and I decided to shoot this video because it just looks so stunning and uh, we're losing a bit of light so if you've been to the channel welcome back if you're new here it's all about living in Guernsey in the Channel Islands and um, we've got a good drive along today we end up in the west coast and just a uh, different vibe in this video I don't normally do videos this late in the evening and you can see there's a bit of traffic, people maybe getting back from work. We've had probably one of the nicest days we've had all year. It's been about 17 degrees, which is pretty good for March, which is the time of shooting this video. And it's one of those evenings that is so relaxing and stunning as the sun goes down. And I wanted to try and catch the vibe on this video very little wind which is quite rare for Guernsey you know if you've lived here or you've been here because we're an island uh, we get quite a bit of wind on the island a lot of the time so I'm going through some lanes really small lanes and um, nice scenery this is typical of Guernsey the, the roads so it's quite a lot of lanes like this on the island and uh, you know houses dotted round turn right here and go down quite a tight road and as we get further along you'll see what I mean about meeting cars because this is two way believe it or not so it means you're going to meet traffic and where do you pull in well that's a million dollar question sometimes one of you has to reverse down the road um, if you're lucky you'll have like a driveway or something you can pull into you normally use your common sense, one of you will pull in and one of you will uh, you know, wave and just acknowledge the fact they pulled in and um, you know everyone's alright. Now and again if you meet the wrong person um, could have a problem, sometimes people don't want to reverse and things like that but 99% of the time it's fine. So we're just heading uh, up towards the top, we're going to come out Around the west coast, we're very, we're very, we're in the lanes just by the west coast, if that makes sense. And um, I haven't met anything at the moment, which is good, but um, I do in a bit later on. Uh, I've got my lights on, the trees look lovely against the skyline, and um, we're having a really nice week actually, weather wise. By the way, if you want to see more stuff all about Guernsey, have a look around the channel because I've got loads of stuff. It's not just drive-alongs. Um, I do walk-alongs and pretty much everything to do at Guernsey now. And if you uh, do like the stuff, do like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more stuff about Guernsey, you know what to do. You can always um, subscribe to the channel if you want to see more. So... Um, uh, things like this, I mean this wasn't bad car slowed down but you know you meet someone at the wrong point if you're going too fast you can have an accident so you do have to drive at a really safe speed around here, you can see there's no room for, um, there's not a lot of thinking time if you're travelling fast in the lanes so you've got to go at a slow pace wow it looks lovely right so we're going straight on here does anyone recognise around here? Let me know. I live around here, it's really, really familiar. On the right there, that white building, that's like a, it's called Office Point, it sells office goods. I've got a garage on the right. The road narrows a lot down here. There's traffic parked here, which doesn't help, but um, it's not too bad. You can see we're slowly losing the light of the day. When it starts sort of losing light, it goes quite quick, I find. So I've done a few videos in the evening, and you only need to film for about 10 or 15 minutes, and 
by the end of the video it's getting really dark now look this is a good case of meeting a car so there isn't room for us to get through uh, I didn't really have anywhere decent I could reverse and the car noticed that and they just reverse back for you so this is what happens or we pulls in somewhere and normally you'll just get past a car and you'll meet another which is exactly what's happening here so that's one but you can see it as easy someone to pull in always wave at them say thank you carry on you can see again these lanes aren't very big at all that building on the right there that white building with the flag flying in the garden so that big white place there that was uh, a care home that was Sonju Villa I think uh, it used to be called, yeah, it used to be a care home called Sonju Villa it's changed now, it's uh, flats for rents have turned into flats I only know that because uh, I used to do a bit of work there now yeah, so we're going ahead into the lanes again But I hope you're sort of seeing, you know, what what what's round in Guernsey, the lane part of the island. The, these lanes are all over the island, by the way. This isn't unique to where I am. You'll find these all around the island. There's probably more of these lanes than anything else. We obviously have main roads. What what we would class as main roads, but to UK standards they're not even as big as an A road well they're, they're around the size of an A road maybe but you know, obviously we haven't got A roads as such we've just got roads, normal roads the maximum speed limit's 35 so there's no motorways on Guernsey obviously no A roads, none of that just just small little roads, I suppose you'd describe them as. Sun's going down gently. Uh, where are we? We're going to turn right in a minute, and this will take us to the coast. Where are we? Yeah. Where's the turning? It's just here on the right. This road I'm about to drive down, I don't know if it's just me, but it is so bumpy this road. I reckon it's one of the bumpiest roads in Guernsey, and we've got quite a few, but it really was bouncing around this road. The thing is, you can't really notice it on camera because my camera I use has got a stabilisation system built in, and it automatically levels out all the bumps so you don't see them as a viewer. It keeps the it keeps this, this footage quite still, which is really good. But believe me, uh, when I was driving down here, it, it, it's really bumpy, this road. So I'm just going to uh, drive to the end here. And of course you can go left or right, whichever way you go. I'm going to go right, because I'm heading home. And uh, that's as far as I'm going to go today. Thanks for watching. Click the screen if you want to watch another video. And if you like the stuff, give it a thumbs up and remember to subscribe. And I'll see you next time.